Hello, my name is Michael Ernst and I'm the director of the US Atlas T1 facility at Brookhaven National Laboratory. This is a community effort. So in collaboration with our colleagues from the worldwide uh, LHC community, we started building this facility out of components that uh, were developed in conjunction with data grid projects in Europe but also in the US. Hello, my name is Tony Chan and you're here in the uh, computing facility for the uh, US Atlas Tier 1 area. And uh, I want to show you, introduce you to our robotic systems. As you see here, there are three robotic systems behind me here. Uh, there are thousands of tapes uh, available in each of the robots. Uh, it is used primarily for storing data for the experiments, including the uh, Tier 1 facility for Atlas. Um, and all this data that is stored here is later on transported to the computers you see back there for data analysis and processing. Come on over here, let me show you some of the other computers that we have here. You also see in our facility how the noise level is very elevated and the reason for that is because we provided extra cooling for all the computers we have in our facility. Um, they are available not only cooling from the floor, but also cooling from the tops, as you see on the units above the racks. Come on over and I'll show you some of the Atlas-specific computing. What you see here is a brand new switch uh, that's gonna serve as the basis for connecting all the Atlas computers together. The reason this is important is because we decided to introduce a very high-performance network equipment in order to meet the needs, the computing needs of the facility. My name is Ofer Rind and I'm a physicist here working at the BNL Atlas Tier 1 facility. And what you see behind me is some of our of almost 3,000 CPUs dedicated to crunching the Atlas data. We have almost 2 million gigabytes of distributed storage here and we crunch on this data 24-7. The amount of data that uh, will be coming in here from CERN will be enough to fill a CD per second. In order to meet the challenging needs of the coming years, BNL is building an addition to the uh, Brookhaven computing facility that will be ready next year to house the computing for the next six years.